Creating and recovering BIOS using a USB flash drive on an HP laptop. If your system already has an HP underscore tools volume partition, then you can try the BIOS recovery by pressing Windows plus B and power key combinations. The complete process is covered in this video. In this video, we will create and recover BIOS using a USB flash drive. This method will be useful for the systems that have hard drive failure or no longer have access to the HP underscore tools volume partition. For this to work, we will need an empty USB flash drive of at least 20 megabytes in capacity and a FAT file system. To create the BIOS recovery USB, first visit support.hp.com from your browser. Click on this software and drivers link. Since we are working with a laptop, we will click laptop here. Here we can enter our laptop's model name or the serial number. Mine is an HP Pavilion Gaming 15 laptop. It finds my laptop model. Select it to move forward. But if you are unable to search by your model name or serial number then, you can let HP detect your laptop model automatically by clicking here. Click OK for product detection. It will take some time to detect your laptop's model. Once detected, verify it, and then click on it to move forward. Here select your operating system. It was auto-detected for us as Windows 10. Then select your operating system version. It is Windows 10 64-bit for us. If you have no idea about the version then search system in the search box, and click on system information. You will see all the information about your system. Next to the system type, we have our version. Click the submit button to continue. Click the plus sign to expand all drivers. Under that, we can see BIOS listed. Click on it to expand. We can see the HP Notebook BIOS with version number, size, and date. Click the download link. This pop-up will appear. Clicking on OK Get Started will download the HP Support Assistant. Since we will download it manually, we will click here. Now the executable will start downloading. Once the download is completed, run the executable. Click Next to continue. Accept the license agreement and click Next. Here we can provide a path for extracted files. We will keep the default path and click Next. The extraction process will start. Here it is telling about this BIOS utility. Click Next to continue. As we want to create a BIOS recovery USB flash drive, we will select the second option. Then click Next. Now at this point, connect your empty USB drive to your laptop. Now click the refresh button. You will be able to see the USB drive listed. If we click on it, we can see a warning. It states that the minimum capacity of the USB flash drive should be 20 megabytes, and it should have a FAT file system. So we will first format the drive. Formatting from here may or may not work. For me it didn't, so, we will format it manually. We will right-click on our USB drive icon, and click on Format. Under the file system, we will select FAT32. Then we will click on the Start button. It's a warning stating that the formatting will erase all the contents in the USB drive. That is why we have taken an empty USB drive for the process. Click OK to continue. If such a pop-up appears then, click Yes. The formatting will start. On completion, click OK. Close this window. We can see from the properties of the USB drive that the file system has now changed to FAT32. Now let us continue with the installation process. Here, click Refresh again. The details in the list are updated. Select the USB drive and click Next. The process of creating the BIOS recovery USB will begin. 
It may take a while. After completion, we will click Finish. If the BIOS Update Utility window pops up again, click Cancel. Let us check the contents of the USB drive. We will see these two folders. Also, our USB drive name is changed to HP underscore tools. Our BIOS recovery USB flash drive is created and ready for use. To recover your system's BIOS using the BIOS recovery USB flash drive, power off your laptop first. Then plug the AC adapter into the laptop. Insert the BIOS recovery USB drive that we just created into any USB port of your laptop. Press and hold the Windows key and the B key at the same time and keep them pressed. Press and hold the power button for 1 or 2 seconds. Then release the power button. Continue holding the Windows and B keys until the HP BIOS update or recovery screen opens. Now, depending on your laptop model, the screen may remain dark for a few seconds or a minute. Once you see the HP BIOS update or recovery screen, release both the Windows and the B key. The BIOS update or recovery will start automatically. It will first write the BIOS image. Then it will verify the updated or recovered BIOS. When it is completed, you will see the message, the system BIOS recovery is complete. It will automatically restart your system. It will take some time to complete the BIOS recovery process. At this BIOS recovery prompt, press the Enter key to continue loading Windows. After BIOS recovery, your laptop may restart a few times and take a while to load your Windows. We have successfully created a BIOS recovery USB drive and recovered the laptop's BIOS using it. This video covered the process for HP laptops. For other manufacturers the process will be similar and you can search and download the relevant BIOS utility for your laptop from your manufacturer's website. Let us know briefly about BIOS and some scenarios when we may be required to recover it. BIOS, Basic Input Output System, is the most essential software in all computer systems. It performs a power-on self-test to initialize hardware and devices connected to the computer as well as helps run the operating system. If the BIOS on your computer becomes corrupted, the computer fails to boot to the operating system. BIOS may get corrupted due to reasons like power failure during BIOS update, dried CMOS battery, damaged BIOS chip, incompatible hardware or software on your system, or malware or virus infections. If you encounter any of the following issues after restarting your computer then, you may need to recover the BIOS. BIOS Application Error 501 is displayed. CMOS Reset 502 fails. The power light or charging light continues to blink. The computer turns on and you might hear the internal fan, but the display is blank and operating system does not start. The computer stops at a black or blank screen when turned on. The operating system does not start and the caps lock or number lock keys blink, or the computer beeps. If you like the information then, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for your time and patience. Have a nice day.